Good morning, morning everyone. Good morning. It's August the 27th, Tuesday. It's about 8 o'clock in the morning. It's 34 degrees here in Banff. We're headed to, uh, we had a nice birthday party for Sarah at the Sky Bistro up on top of uh, the gondola. We, we took a gondola up to uh, the Sky Bistro and at 7,000 feet had dinner last night. It's cold up there, but it's kind of cold this morning. It's 34 degrees. We're headed to Lake Louise and try to get there before the crowd so we get a parking space and, and explore what Lake Louise has to offer. So come on, bring you along. Bring you along. Let's go. Good morning. We made it here at Lake Louise. Um, parking is really bad here. It took us almost like uh, 35 minutes, 40 minutes to get a parking space. And anyway, it's a beautiful lake and uh, we're going to walk around and enjoy the view. Let's go. We're going to Lake Agnes Tea House. Come on. All right. Have some tea and crumpets. latte, brownie, mountain bars, and cookie okay. to start, and, and hot it? cocoa for Sarah with marshmallow. Yay. Okay. Sandwiches are coming second after dessert. Uh, we're leaving Lake Louise. We just did the St. Agnes Tea House Trail. Uh, it was a modern trail. It was couple hours to get up there and about 40 minutes to get down we had a uh, we got filled up at, at the tea house some tea and some sandwiches headed back down and now we're leaving Lake Louise and headed to Golden we're headed to go to ATV and we'll bring you along let's go Well, can I, uh, can I 
Yeah, he, he probably won another one. Yeah, can I, borrow, can I get another one? Yeah. I want to put this on my head. Sure. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to give you guys some home balance for me. Yeah, yeah. How's that? It's good. It's good? Okay. Just strict passengers for the tour? Yeah. Okay, no problem. So the drivers need to pay more attention really than the passengers here. Uh, to get them started, you have a key that just gives you power, okay? Mm -hmm. And then to start the actual engine. <laughs> get the gas going okay when you want to slow down just let go of the gas the machine's automatically going to slow down and then you got your primary brake up there okay it does all the tires a little more emphasis on the front tires though but you're not going to go flying over the handlebars like a bike so you can grab it as hard as you need to there's also a foot brake on the right hand side it's not that functional it just locks the back tires up it's more for if you're parked and stop okay so just make sure you're not standing on it while you're driving though because the engine will overpower the brakes and then you'll oh, okay. destroy your brakes, mm -hmm. okay? And they, they do a share of reservoir, so if you destroy your back brakes, it's gonna destroy oh, all the brakes, okay? okay? So just make sure. Seven is the Kicking Horse Canyon there, and that's where you would have came through if you came from Banff, and that was carved out by the river. <coughs> yeah, they do uh, tandem um, and regular paragliding off the top of Mount Seven there. Not not the main peak, but off to the right there, you can drive up. That's wild. Wow. Probably be an awesome day for it today with things warming up. They did the, they've got the uh, North America distance record from up there. Flew all the way down the Columbia Valley into the States. Wow. A long, long way. Over 300 kilometers. Not sure what that is in miles, but. Well, the, on the sign up at the top there it says it was 332 miles. Holy shit. Okay. That's a lot. I'm undershooting that a little bit. 300 <laughs> kilometers would be far enough. Yeah. Um, 